The roads can be dangerous to travel on. The lack of proper road construction left many of them bumpy and riddled with obstructions. Only those with a death wish would ride alone. So, many would join caravans or hire armed mercenaries to protect their cargo. For the true threat was from the highwaymen, thieves and outlaws who would wait along the roads and rob travelers at gunpoint. One of these highwaymen is named Dismas. Based on his dialogue, he may have been a candle maker before turning to a life of crime. And it's worth noting that does not include robbing travelers on the road. It's possible that before he took up the blade, he was just a con man. He may have been conning people in games of chance, since he's regarded as a known cheat by the time he arrives at the hamlet. It's also implied that he's been imprisoned for his crimes. Whether this is before or after he became a highwayman is unknown, but it's an interesting fact about his life. We see that he's a skilled marksman with unparalleled finesse. Armed with his pistol and dirk, we see him stop a stagecoach and immediately gun down the driver. He then slices a second man's throat, and from behind him he hears something. His reflexes kick in, and he turns and fires his pistol into the stagecoach, thinking it was another guard. As he walks closer to the wagon, he realizes he made a grievous mistake. He had killed a woman and her son. All he could do is look on in horror. While many think that this is his wife and son, since he does keep a locket with their picture in it as one of his trinkets, or that it is actually Reynald's wife and son, and that would explain why Dismas is accompanying Reynald on his journey to the hamlet, but we know both of these theories to be false. Rather, he was set up by someone or some group. How do we know this? Well, let's just say a little birdie told us. This moment would have a profound effect on Dismas. After this, he would turn away from his life of crime and focus on his redemption. This is what would bring him to the hamlet. He's seeking redemption on this old road. And this is why he's carrying that locket. It's a reminder of his sins, a way for him to show penance for his actions and maintain focus on why he's here. While well, Dismas is here for a spiritual redemption, others travel to the hamlet for a more academic pursuit, for the estate boasts a plethora of bizarre fungi, diseases, and injuries. The perfect place for an aspiring doctor to practice their trade. 